Hi, I'm Inherit Jones, and I'm from the Urban Craft Center in Santa Monica, California, and I'm here to show you how to decoupage a votive candle. Um, so a votive candle is a smaller candle. Uh, I don't want to cover it with too much because as it burns down, it might become a fire hazard, but a little image is okay. So I've cut this little image of a car out of this bigger sheet of lots of cars, and I just chose one little one. And I'm going to use Mod Podge, which is a decoupage glue. Uh, it comes in a bunch of different finishes. This one's matte. You can get ones that dry shiny or even sparkly. I like this one because it's, uh, it doesn't take away from the image I'm using. And decoupage glue, you start by putting a little bit of glue on the uh, object you're decoupaging rather than the image itself. So you start by placing a small, uh, brushing on a small layer and you're going to take the image and you're going to press it into place wherever you want it. Actually, this one's a little stiff, so I'm going to pre-roll it a little bit. Press it into place. I wish it would cooperate. And then you put a little bit of glue over top of it. Now it's going to dry clear, so I'm not worried about the fact that it's white. I'm going to press it down with my fingers a little bit. And then reapply some glue. And once it dries clear, what you'll see is the car. So that's uh, that's decoupaging a votive candle. So I'm Inherit Jones at the Urban Craft Center in Santa Monica, California. Happy crafting!